Hello everybody and welcome to Nerds New Sexy Shiny Force Let's Play Part 11. In case you missed it, Part 10 was live streamed on Twitch on my Twitch channel. Hopefully Part 20 and 30 and so on, every 10 parts, will be streamed on Nerds New Sexy's Twitch channel. So keep an eye out for when that happens. Let's go ahead and continue on our story. During the live stream, there might have been some technical issues that hopefully have been fixed. We got both Birdman, uh, Amon and Bar uh, Barbaros, and we got the Wolfman. So now we have to go fight um, in a ridge. Let me double check, make sure everyone's alive. All right, let's go fight the laser eye. Come on, you need to move. There you go. Oh, that's not the laser eye here. Uh, it is one of the annoying maps, though. Yeah, I'm supposed to go all the way over there. All right, so the best way to go in a sense, would be go up this way. Like, I'd be wor uh, weary of the Pegasus Knights. 21 attack. Then they got the snipers here, or Dark Elves. Lizardmen, Dark Priests. Okay, so let's go on with it, shall we? Oh, come on, May. Surprised the uh, Dark Elves haven't gone to attack Tau yet. Movement is going to suck because every, almost everyone on my party, I want to say like 90% of people on my party, can only move two spaces when they're in the forest, mountains, or in the desert. Wait, what? Is it going to heal? Medical herb, yes it is. Wasn't expecting this, you know, an undead being to use a uh, healing item. Let's go ahead and attack the Stark Elf over here with Xylo. The new addition to the force. He packs one hell of a punch. At least against, uh, Dark Elves. Now, as I said on the live stream for part 10, I can promote any character once they reach level 10. But I'm not going to. I'm going to wait till about level 13 or 15 to promote them. Uh, because once you promote, their stats kind of lower a bit, but they are able to go above their initial level cap. Which, in Shining Force 1, the level cap for a non-promoted character is... Uh, 25 if I recall correctly then once you promote them they can go up to level 99 if you had that much time to grind now I can grind off uh, recordings to make the game a bit easier but where's the fun in that you guys have already witnessed me die a few times <laughs> the pure unbridled rage of dying 
I love it. They're undead. I'll go and use Blaze. Try to get Honorary leveled up as well to at least 10. the end of, or in, you know, somewhere in part 10, I made sure everyone was equipped with the best items they can obtain as well. So for Gort, that would be the uh, Great Axe. Um, Luke still has his long sword. I don't know when I'll be able to upgrade that for him. Speed by two, maximum hit points by one. I am curious as to why they are all hanging back. I've never seen the AI do this where they literally just wait. Like, that Dark Elf over there should have advanced to attack me, but he didn't for some reason. Okay, so the Pegasites are retreating. That's curious. I think that's what makes this a long battle. Not the, not just the fact that the, the battlefield is so large and you move, you don't move a whole lot. It's the fact that one they're all spaced out pretty far, but they retreat so so much. Like here, I'm already getting hung up. Other than Zylo. And a few others. I'm already getting hung up on where I can put my uh, characters. Uh, I'm gonna go for the Lizardman. I could go for the Dark Priest so make sure he doesn't heal the Lizard, but that would put me right up against the Lizard. He could attack easily. And I want to avoid that as much as possible. See, he's going to heal. That is curious. They usually go towards you. Oh, come on, man.
There we go, now it's dead. I should have leveled on her yet. Yep. She is well below level right now, level 7. Everyone else is like 8, 9, or. And a few of them are level 10. Nope, I want that one. Yep, now they're gonna move in to attack. Ooh, a critical for 10. Luke is down. If I get Tao to move in, she might be able to. Really, only four points? Oh shit. There we go, that's more like it. Yeah, see, they're flying away, making this battle drag on even longer. You're gonna move one space, motherfucker. Two healers are ooh a crit and it's an eight. That means you normally do four damage to him. Oh, so now you're gonna attack Xylo. Oh, that's not good. Freeze uses three magic. I want to preserve as much magic as I can in this battle.
Of course you'd go twice before Xyla would go once. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and move away. I'll worry about the lizard men, the lizard man and dark priest on the right. Um, oh, mountain's gonna cut it down even more. My movement speed. These guys are literally just gonna let me walk right past them. Nope, there they are, yep, so. My second thought was they are going to try to go behind to ambush. But my main force is already back here. Let's go ahead and have everyone ready to defend back here. Get my healers in close. There you go. Should've done that before, Xylo. And there goes Luke. Or not. Or not Luke, Low. Luke's already gone. Attack by one, defense by one, speed by one. Blaze is level two. Okay, that's very awesome. Let's let that dark priest uh, run out of mana. It's going to take us a while before, but oh well. Critical of 20. Level 10 already. Let's 
Speed by two? Jesus. Like, really, I don't need to move these guys anymore. Because I have Hans and, uh... Oh, no. Damn it. I actually want to move Xylo in. He... He's a fast mover. Like, literally, now, it's all just a matter of time before I kill them. That's fun. You're literally just feeding XP to Hans. Every time he attacks. Now that maze up here. Now it's game over since I have some more people here to out damage their heals. There it is. Yeah, you can't do anything, can you? You're the last one left. You little bastard. Oh, come on. Quickly evades. I can't do anything. But May and Hans can. Ooh, nice double. And Maze level 10. Now, I can't remember if I go across. Yep, this is the battle with the laser eye. It literally attacks anything in its sight. Can I? No, it needs to be my main character. I'll come back to this fight in part 12. It's an annoying one. Eh. I won't, I, I won't spoil how the mechanics work here. I just gotta get through all the character rotations. There we go. Let's go ahead and go down to this uh, town. Where I can go resurrect Luke. Because Luke's the only one I uh, lost in the previous battle. And I'm going to go ahead and save.
Thank you all so much for watching episode 11. Keep an eye out for episode 12. And remember, stay nerdy, stay sexy, always.